okay hope you love the snip of the video make sure you watch the whole video on youtube yes can't leave you alone please ah. don't leave us alone here and reggae just mm. it's a lovely video and nice yes. song there yes and okay. we have one barry moss is about to come through giving us some reggae facts today oh. mm. barry yes See, yes yes, yes. Hello. Hello. Thanks for that. Uh, uh -huh. DJ Gangsman. Yes. You uh -huh. it? Oh, oh, thank you very much. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't give it. <laughs> Okay, so today happens to mm -hmm. be a special day as well because uh, Masai has done us one better. Mm -hmm. He has. Uh, hooked us up with some facts on Twitter. So head mm -hmm. to our Twitter handle, that is at y254 channel mm -hmm. on Twitter. Uh, and uh, you'll find a stream of them. I'll just sample a few so we can give you a taste of what's happening. But I loved what happened uh, in the reggae gist. Mm -hmm. Thanks for the info. Uh -huh. Anytime. Yes, how, Valentine. How many millions did Tommy Lee spend again? <laughs> you <laughs> budget your canal. 20, over 20 million. What? Yes, for three years. Where so imagine you own a show, you go to Dex, but you gonna as in you na balance your career like what you na join a camp. What is that even? Is that How? life? That is Ezekiel Mutua in Jamaica. <laughs> I feel yeah. like also the amount uh -huh. is also included the fact that he has not been attending events. Mm. You, you get, get fined for not going for an event. Like not attending events because Super Bowl, the 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 officers are like, if you if we don't scratch out Tommy Lee, huh. you're not issuing a permit for the event to happen. So Tommy Lee has to, to, not to appear. Not having an, an easy time. Yeah. So uh, why is Tommy Lee being uh, single like that? Because of, of his uh, lyrics. Yes. But how it's many so of them? I don't know. have vibes to mm -hmm. cater. I don't have vibes to say. I don't know. Pop can. Don't hate speech on Popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> don't do right. it. It's but Popcorn is also Love guilty there. as judge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Popcorn also has some really nasty lyrics. Yeah, like if they can go to our somewhere in Jamaica, I'm telling you, all of them would be hearted. It would be, it would be a he good thing. He would have work to do. Ezekiel Mutua has been the topic of conversation. Probably he's also involved in the gangs and the old gangs that are going down in Jamaica. Like openly. Mm -hmm. Because that is that probability. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You All right. So where is Tommy Lee it, right now? He being guy, he's so he's being harassed. Yes, as we speak. He's is somewhere. He's somewhere like being the diamond man. and being the previous diamond. I feel like he's not yet released. All in one life. He's still locked up. I'd like to send a shout out to DJ Kingsman himself uh, to make what you can enjoy the mixes. Uh, yes, and uh, you're welcome again. And again and again, DJ Kings, man. We appreciate you. Mm. Uh -huh. Hi, Barry. Hi. I'm glad you're upset. But I really want those facts now, please. Okay. Yeah, you came promising us things. Imagine Don't be like uh, the government. Like about to just close the show. Yeah. Yeah. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're waiting. Uh -huh. Don't be like that. You just have to. You have to. You have to tease it. You have to. Uh. You have to. <laughs> <laughs> you have to make the mouth water. Just like my but anyway, anyway, okay. <laughs> anyway, back to the facts now. Uh. As I see, they are on our Twitter handle. That is at Y254 channel, and uh, there's a stream of them. I'll just sample a few. But before I sample them, I'd like to ask a question. Do you know where the term reggae came from? No. You should ask that. Yes, Chopi. Let's start Let's start from there. Kingsman. Chopi is famous. Kingsman is cool kid. Kingsman is cool kid. Kingsman is cool spot. Kingsman is cool kid. Kingsman is cool kid. Kingsman is cool <laughs> All right, straight ahead. So I'll read it. It's believed that the word reggae comes from uh, a Jamaican slang term called reggae reggae, which means ragged or raggedy because it's a mix of styles sewn together. Raggedy. Mixed of styles. Yes. So sewn together. Sewn together. So mm. that we can say dance or raga or redeems the falling under. There's someone Wait, who once told word. me. Raggedy. But oh. why? You, yeah, you know, look like you're about to say that shit also. Yeah, you know, raggedy, you know, raggedy is associated with something that's just of your obvio, you yeah. know. Or I'm a, I'm a it is not really your obvio. It's <laughs> rough on the edges <laughs> sometimes. You're not obvio, obvio. You're rough on the edges and you're not obvio. All right, <laughs> All right. on to our next fact. But, and this but one is... Sorry to chat. Can, can we still digest as well? All right, let's <laughs> digest. What did you just say? Digest. You were about to say something. Like, because uh, uh, he said, like, um, it's more of a mixture of, uh -huh. of songs, uh, uh -huh. different genres. 
So do should we put dancehall is form of a reggae? I think so. And there's one person who told me hip hop na reggae zu zu una kapata kid. Eh yeah. hey, like kuna venye there's there's some type of vibes that you find in hip hop that you also find in reggae. So that I can believe. Oh, yes, so let me have a question, like, have a question. Yes, yes. So work the the work that uh the, the song work 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 by Hana mm. uh featuring Drake. So uh can that be a form of reggae? Yeah, because she's wearing reggae colors, and then there's that. And then the video, the first clip of yeah, the video, she's yeah, in Caribbean. Yeah. But no, the whole thing is themed Caribbean. It's <laughs> yes. even in the Caribbean, though. But yes. thank you. You know, I'm the hey, kind of people. You want Michelle to beat me? I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Next, next. All right, next. I'll do it next. Okay. Right. Okay. This story is, is uh, very interesting. Mm -hmm. In 1973, Bob Marley's band, uh, the Whalers, were fired in the middle of a tour. Do you want to know why? Why? <laughs> when they were opening for Sly and the Family Stone, it was because uh, they were much more popular with the audience than the main act. Oh, okay. no. Shots fired. So back in 1973, if you were supporting act, you were not allowed to be, to get... To overshine uh, the... Yes. Oh, my. But I feel it like that kind of problem still is around. Oh, <laughs> Fungulia DJ, alafu unasikia, hey. Umetesa sana, you'll never come here again. Amu shai funguliwa. Anakuja tu kupangu za sweti ya audience. Alafu unamele sasa uni nani, sasa uni meleta. Tesa hivya. Maze. Yes, okay, all right. Not even that, when you when you over, when you over, when you outshine the main act, the main act unakuja tu kupangu za fan sweat. Hilda, you really know how to throw shade. Mi ni kuhadhari utasema kupanga, kupanga, kupaka rangi men, ati kuwa ipu nini? Unakuja kupanguza sweat, when you're nasty, sasa. Alright. 22162, guys. So the thing is, the same thing like our opening arches, it applies for the same thing like opening arches. Yes, sometimes. Like it's open up for Beyonce. Uh-huh. You cannot change. Tessa, Tessa. Hey, Beyonce. Kama Rihanna kuenda kumungi ya Beyonce stage. Do you imagine Rihanna overdoing? Out. No, no, it's it, no, over it's so outdoing, <laughs> overdoing, under it. Uh, <laughs> no, it's not happening, next, guys. Next, next one. On to the next one. If you follow uh, the UK music right now, okay. you can tell there's a lot of Caribbean influence yeah. in the urban uh, British music. Yeah. So this is a, a fun fact that relates to that. And it goes something like, in 1960, the Island Records began importing Jamaican music to the UK. A brief Jamaican uh, dance craze paved the way for reggae to enter the global mainstream. Soon, artists like Neil Diamond and the Beatles were making music conspicuously, conspicuously reggae-ish. So that was just common ah. when you just, you know, conspicuously reggae. Exactly. Also, <laughs> reggae. I don't have to say that mm. right now. Mm. I'm lost. Right. Very I'm lost. Mm. I'm lost. Sorry, uh. again. But is this again is a kitambo? Sorry, one more time. Yeah, what happened? Very. Right. Oh, the Island millennial. Records started importing mm. reggae music to, mm -hmm. to the UK, okay. which led to the reggae music going mainstream and worldwide. <laughs> and uh, soon, uh, artists like Beatles started having reggae-ish sounds in their undertones. I like so, that uh, conspicuous reggae ish sound. Yeah. Vocabulary. <laughs> So, so kisema conspicuous reggae, she, then it's just live live, there's some reggae in there, it. There is, yes. but we're not saying it's reggae. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Really, Elephant in the uh, room. <laughs> but it, reggae has really influenced the, the sound that is uh, global right now, or the popular sound of the pop culture. Mm -hmm. You can tell even the hip-hop artists and the R&B artists have some Name conspicuous. Mm -hmm. Or oh, we, uh, we have Western. We have. Uh, See what you did there. Uh -huh. We have. Uh, we have Drake. Mm -hmm. We have Wizkid. But Drake. Okay. All right. Uh, so it has really influenced a lot mm -hmm. of uh, popular culture right now. Well, oh. well, 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 well. Yeah, Valentine, I'd like you to give the DJ the microphone because I'd like him to tell us which track he has that's not reggae but it's conspicuously reggae-ish. Let me come back story. Wait. Cool kid, okay. you with me? Right. Oh, so the song Cranium, uh, is it Cranium featuring Wiz Kid? Yeah. Yes. Can believe that. Can believe that. So that's more of a dance song kind of. Yeah. Mm, and tied all the same. Yeah, so. Yeah, as well. Falls under reggae? Yes. Conspicuous. So I'm going to I'm to leakage. Michelle, na tume tumefanya tume peana mpiani hapa mkakuja kupeana leakage. On that note, we will play that song first. Yeah, actually, uh, those for kind of songs uh, uh -huh. fall under trap dance song. Oh. Ah. Yeah. What? Trap dancer. Kumbe tuko tunonge hapa na the answers were here. Trap is already evolving. 
Because actually, right now, uh, if you can see, reggae is everything. Bro. Yeah. Mm. In order for a DJ to go on a play, you have, to, you have to know how to play reggae, right? <laughs> so, uli sema yeni kuki ya? which leads to our next one which is related to the previous one uh rock steady musicians change their instruments instrumentation shifting away from upbeat horns and ska uh the guitar bass oh bass rather <laughs> drums and organs common to british american rock bands musicians uh turned increasingly increasingly to the rastafarian religion evolving into reggae and that's a lot of information Maze, okay yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. summarize for us me i'm stuck right. on the rock religion steady is a, is, is a genre of music mm -hmm. so they evolved into into this reggae it's conspicuously <laughs> reggae <-ish. laughs> yes and uh, rock steady is uh is is from or is originally from the uk as well okay. so I'm, I'm trying to understand this reggae thing but your english is a lot so you conspicuously so what we are saying is mm -hmm. there's reggae somewhere where it's reggae uh, in rock Oh. In rock steady, yes, exactly. Ah. Very good student. So, so basically, they even discovered that does not make me a bad student. Reggae. Excuse me. Is this some genres of reggae? <laughs> what? No, but two two, two one six book? two is the text I saw with Y M two five four. We are in class today. We're uh -huh. being taught reggae history. Thank you so very much, Masai. We appreciate you. And the teacher of the day is at its very more. I am at Kalamiva. We have DJ Kingsman at Hilda Wadidi and at Michelle. Eh, ya mwishoni. Michelle? Yeah, Michelle, ni, kwamba, but it's only facts. We are not mm -hmm. in We know the info. Mm -hmm. uh, but facts. shout out to Masai as well. Mm -hmm. Yes, for uh, cooking them up or rather. They're <laughs> finished. Uh -huh. yeah. Today we have I, discovered. I was just sampling a few because there's so many of them on our Twitter. Can we have oh. one more, please? One more. Yeah. One more. Let me find one about uh, who loves Bob Mali. Me. That is not question. He's right. founder of the nation. Let's find <laughs> something about Bob Marley. And uh, yes, the last okay. one is about Bob Marley. And Bob Marley had nine children. Uh, virtually all of them inherited their father's passion in music and have con contributed to the, his legacy in the reggae music since uh, his death in 1981. All of okay. them were musicians. That's it. Thank in you. fact, there's like a time we had a uh, reggae gist and you talked about the uh, when they were having awards or something and it was Chronology, Chronic's album versus mm -hmm. the Mali family. Yeah. And the Mali's won simply yeah. because they have such an amazing PR team. Like they're uh, a, an empire in mm -hmm. themselves. Like <coughs> Apuakuna. Vaga. Uh, Chronic's versus the Mali. There is something about people the, who The create. album Chronology was Chronic's and then the Mali had their own album. But they won. Damien, it was Damien Mali. Yeah. yeah. Uh. So Chronix was a bit upset with it and went on social media. Oh. He ranted. Yeah. Everyone. Chronology like, uh, was epic. I'm um, guy. If you if you're a fan, you know Chronology was epic. I think this was about the Grammys, yeah. When yeah, uh, Damien Mali won the Grammys, yeah. mm. and uh, Chronix missed, and Chronix didn't like uh, send a message of congratulations <laughs> to Damien. So people you? sent a salty one. Yes, sometimes you just be a good loser. <laughs> but I feel but like same, it's yeah? an issue. Cause Thank you. Yeah, it's an issue if uh, a, a Bob Marley or a Marley keeps uh -huh. winning consistently. Yeah, just because thing. you have the name. All right, ah. but... Uh, so that means no other artist or, or it you doesn't don't have a fighting that. chance. No, it doesn't mean but that. It's All right, but uh, how many albums does uh, Damien have out yet? Clearly Chronix is... is, is I, I don't want to say he's starting. Help me here. Uh, what but, is he saying? <laughs> at a, at a but, <laughs> but, okay. but Damien has been doing this for a while. You don't just come into the game and win a Grammy. It happens rarely. Help yeah, actually, actually, uh, the reason, uh, basically, why I think uh, Damien won is, uh, yeah. if you listen to the album, mm -hmm. like it's it's a vast album, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. But uh, the the uh, the songs that were in chronology <laughs> yeah basically is like based on the rastafarian the culture you know, and the struggle of rasta right uh -huh. Uh -huh. so <laughs> 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 
So, so the Grammy is run by white people. But I have another question. We had to break the race. Like Vibes Cartel yeah. has been into this game for a while, dance and he has never won a Grammy. Oh yeah. Maybe they need to introduce like. I don't think they can do yeah. that, man. Those guys. Because he's been <laughs> into the game for a while, and he has never won a Grammy. And he's a well known. Only silent hall. killer. Like everyone who does yeah. dance hall or reggae knows vibes is the king. Okay. It's just I don't know why it's never teacher, been given. Boss. See now you're talking to Chai, you're not being heard. Yeah. See, maybe they don't wanna give teacher, these people awards because they don't want to encourage their youth to follow in their footsteps. Because they have like uh, for you to win a Grammy it's more than just uh, being known or yeah. have a huge crowd That's of fans. Yeah. What, what we need to learn from this, uh, the, the the music uh, the music thing is a journey. Yeah, Chronix has as a as a as a way to go. He still has uh, more albums to release. He has more Grammy awards to be nominated. Did you guys <laughs> notice something interesting when you were talking about Bob Marley's nine children? Mm. It's mm. like everybody who starts an empire or a tribe must have nine children. Speaking for the Gikuyu crew, okay? Yes, Gikuyu and Bobby Bobby had nine children. I just saw everyone. I just saw All right, I had caught a feeling over here about Chronix. <laughs> Thank you. For you for <laughs> need nine ah! children. I'm ready. Kuzatu. Kuzatu. Minji Minji or the first wife? <laughs> the Minji Minji is the one, the younger wife. All right. Minji Minji. 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 What is yeah, Minji Minji? What is a Minji Minji? Minji Minji is the, the younger wife. Yeah. Oh, she's called Minji Minji. Yeah, yeah, Minji. Oh, oh, the the last time Minji. you checked. Hey, look at her face. Is so, <laughs> Minji is different from Minji Minji. When you say it twice, it's different. <laughs> Huh? I'm just curious. <laughs> Head straight to our Twitter handle, Y254 channel. Is it more facts from Masai Kita? Shout out to Masai Kita. 22162 is the SMS line. Uh, start with YM254. Uh, don't forget to leave your name. And where you're watching us from? Um, Barry Moses. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm Hilda Wadidi. Uh, Michelle Oshira. And Buster Movie is coming right about after this. And you have been watching Reggie. Excuse, excuse, yes. excuse. Hi, hi, hi. Can right now. Also, so even Buster move right now. Look at Michelle. <laughs> no, I am <laughs> going to say what I want to say. <laughs> Guys, again, please remember, we yes. just turned one year old. Yes, White 54 has been on air for one year, and we have a campus tour. So what do you do? Slide into our everything, our media handles. We have White 54 on Facebook, White Money TV show on Instagram, White 254 channel on Twitter, and of course, pay YouTube to go pare pare, White 254 channel, yes? Our hashtag is Why in the Morning by Varys. Today is Reggae Thursday. 22162, you are muhimu though. You start with YM254. So if you're in a campus somewhere, first of all, just know we're going to come to a campus near you. And if you want to invite us, please do. We'll come through. Our hashtag is Y254 Campus Tour. So I am at Kalami Val with everyone else and at Shiko Kaitani and at Shiko Kaitani. Oh, well, we're taking your time, Val. Well, let's yes. take our time. All right, so okay, DJ so Kingsman. DJ, yes. What do you have lined up for? DJ will, will be playing uh, Cranium and we're not going anywhere. <laughs> 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 that is not a request. That is not a request. request. Please, right. what's your <laughs> request? <laughs> DJ, please. DJ, All right, please DJ Kingsman, take it away. And you'll be like Rasta Party. <laughs> nah. No okay, but the DJ. In sorry, okay. At okay. okay, but I love all these songs. So it says that it's okay, it's yeah, DJ so not going it's anywhere. DJ you're, you're not it's going DJ anywhere. Kingsman but time. Time. It's, it's DJ Kingsman's time. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh.